A nasal cannula provides low concentrations of oxygen, ranging from 24 to 44 percent. Oxygen is delivered to the patient by two soft plastic tips, commonly referred to as nasal prongs, that are connected by thin tubing to the main oxygen source. The prongs rest a short distance inside the patient's nostrils. The main indication for use of a nasal cannula is a patient who feels suffocated by a non-rebreather mask, despite your best coaching and reassurance. A nasal cannula may also be indicated for COPD patients with minimal respiratory distress and for patients who are experiencing nausea or vomiting. You will find that many patients like nasal cannulas because of the device's comfort. A cannula also allows them to talk, making it a lot easier for you to gather a history. Even so, the nasal cannula is not the preferred method of oxygen delivery in the pre-hospital setting. Obviously, it is contraindicated for patients with nasal obstructions. A nasal cannula also should not be used with patients who exhibit chest pain, hypoxia, signs of shock, or other more serious problems that require higher concentrations of oxygen. However, if a patient refuses to wear a mask, the cannula is better than no oxygen at all.